Hello YouTube and everyone, we love her also I'm back here, crazy ass videos, as for the title page, do you think it's worth owning a system for a couple games, or is it better to have a big collection? Um, you know, for me personally, no, it's not worth owning a system just for a couple games. Uh, I'd rather have a big collection, because, you know, I'm not, you know, a game system is not a huge investment, I don't think. I mean, it's not like buying a car or a house here, but it's still one of those things like, okay, what are you buying that system for? What games? You better buy it for some good games there. You better buy it for good exclusives or good third party or multi blocks whatever. Especially exclusives. Those, those are important. But, you know, this generation, you know, a couple years ago, I was this close from buying a 360 for Resident Evil 5. And we all know how that, turn, that, how that game turned out. But, uh, for the 360, I would rather own the multi-plats, you know, on that system because they run better. Uh, but I wouldn't, wouldn't, own, I wouldn't want to own a 360 just for a couple games. I mean, there's a couple games on that system I'd want to own, but they're not, like, like, 360, you know, they're not, like, Halo or Gears or Fable or whatever that shit connect. It's just multi-plats. It's all really, really it is, like Dead Space and Tatsunoko and... Super Street Fighter 4, and whatever. I mean, that's really all it. Mortal Kombat. Um, again, that's a couple of games. Right? What did I name? Like, five, six games there? Four? I mean, it, it's just a couple of games. I'd rather have a... I'd rather buy a system have a big stack of games. I mean, I, I expect... We all expect that, you know, as gamers. Because, well, I hate to admit this, but we're greedy. Gamers are greedy. Uh, and we want to play games after game... We want to play game after game after game. We, we'll, we'll sit there and put... 70, 60, 80, over 100 hours into one game, and then we're done, we're done. We'll go back to it some other time, but we'll, we want to play more games and more games and more games. And that's, in my opinion, you know, that's especially, especially this generation, my Wii. I have over 80 or 90 games for my Wii. That's insane. I mean, that's pretty sad to admit, but not for me. It's not sad to admit, but, you know, I've never bought that game, many games for any systems. I mean, I have a lot of games for each one of my systems, but that's way crazy and I know a lot of people have like especially when you look at PS2 or NES or just any system out there that has tons of games I mean people have thousands of games for each one of their systems I know a lot of people on YouTube have shown their collections and they have like thousands of PS2 games and I don't know how many I don't know, I don't know how people I don't know how you could do that uh, I guess you're getting them used or whatever but anyways and I guess it depends if you have the money to do it or not. That's totally understandable. Money's tight for everyone, for me, for you. And, uh, you know, that's why I game on Nintendo, because I get first-party support and third-party surprises. Because I want a big stack of games. I, know I want that collection to re represent that system. That's the, reason to own, that's the reason to own that system for those games and those exclusives. Because, you know, exclusives are important. But, I don't know. But, I don't know, that, that's just my thing. Anyways, but, yeah, like I said, you know what, a game system is a huge, not, not a huge investment, but it kind of is. And it's one of those things you have to think about before you buy it. Because you want to, are those game is that system worth owning, or are those games worth owning? And it's kind of a hard decision sometimes. And, as gamers, we make decisions all the time. You know, it's really... It's, yeah, kind of overwhelming a little bit, but, you know, we get used to it because we're gamers and that's just the way it is. It's life, I guess, as a gamer. But, I don't know. What are your thoughts on this? Anyways, do you own a system just for a couple games or would you rather have a big collection? I don't know. That's my closing thoughts, so peace out. More videos coming. Later. Bye.